Alrighty, so um, this video is uh, here to show you a little tip, a little trick that, uh, that's been in AutoCAD for many years, but I, I show this to people and I'm actually surprised that they've never seen it. And it, it comes back to what I teach in my AutoCAD class about uh, read your command line. There's a lot of little tips and tricks that can happen if you just read your command line. So um, in this example, I need to copy these this box here this 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 box and I need to copy it I'll just say I need five of them equal distant apart um, whatever that distance is I don't know we'll, we'll figure that out a little while but but I can use the array command or I can use the copy command and then copy it multiple times but inside the copy command there is a little hidden gem with well called array so uh, take a look at this I'm gonna start my copy command okay and following the command prompts, I'm going to select my objects here, okay, and I'm going to hit enter. So I'm done selecting objects. I'm going to pick my base point, and after I pick my base point, I'll pick this bottom left corner right here. After I pick my base point, I immediately look at the command line. There is an option here to do an array, because right now, if I just click over here, I would stop the command. Well, I would not stop the command. I would just drop one there, and then I go and drop another one and drop another one. But I'm going to use the array command. And it says enter the number of items to array. I'm going to use um, I said five, so I'll stay with five. Okay. And as you can see now, I'm copying, and I'll copy in this direction. But I can copy in any direction that I want. I mean, I can even do it at an angle if I prefer. Okay. But I'm just going to go straight across. And whatever the distance is that I pick, it it's equal distant among all these boxes here. So when I click right here and drop it, um, it does it then goes back into the regular copy command at which I can just ex escape or exit and I'm done. But as you can see, it created uh, five separate entities, unlike the array command, which creates um, one object that you might have to explode later. This one does, uh, in this case, five separate entities of the same object. Okay, just a little trick. I, I hope it it helps you out and makes sense. Uh, thank you.